Good morning, everyone. We are back in Incheon. We're actually at Dong Incheon Station, which is where I took you, where we went to walk around the neighborhood called Gehangno, which if you haven't seen that video, I will put it up here. Um, but we are actually not staying as sad as I am. I really want to go back to that cookie place. Um, we are going to hit a bus and head actually closer to the ocean. And we're going to explore Songdo today. Um, it is Songdo International City. I'm sure you've heard of it. Um, it is a kind of one of these more newer cities. It's very beautifully planned out. It's famous for its Central Park. Um, so we're gonna explore. I've never been there before. Kurt is gonna join us for dinner. And um, our first stop is we're going to hit a cafe that overlooks the ocean. Could it not be more perfect? So um, let's grab our bus and head to Songdo. If you want more information, um, please go check out Discover In Chan's Instagram. Um, they were nice enough to sponsor this. So yeah, let's go explore another part of Incheon, Songdo. <laughs> Okay, wow, this place is fancy. I had no idea. It is like bougie here. It is very bougie. But my kaya bun was delicious and it was super chill in there. But we're gonna head into more Songdo city center. We're actually gonna head to a shopping district called Triple Street. I don't even wanna shop. I just wanna see the shopping center in and of itself. I'm excited. I'm actually going to be grabbing a taxi from here. You can technically take the bus, um, but it takes quite a bit longer. So. For time's sake, for you guys, we're taking a taxi. Let's go. Wondering if thousands of miles away, the sky is just as blue. It's as if I'm stuck in yesterday when I'm thinking of you. Cause when you have your morning coffee, I'm turning out the lights so I could dream. And when you smile through the screen, I wish you could be with me. This is wild. This is a huge shopping area that extends like as far as the eye can see. What I want to do though is I have seen people, let me get in the shade. Oh my God. Um, it is toasty today. I have seen people get on this roof and there's apparently a beautiful view. So we're going to attempt to get on the roof. Let's see. I see an escalator, but how far up can I get? Let's see. Adventure time. Ah. It's been months since I've been Nothing over makes me so forgettable and struggling to comprehend. Weirdly enough, this just really reminds me of downtown San Diego. I know that I say that about a lot of cities, but just this like kind of city center with all these brand new buildings and stuff. Um, I'm feel I feel like I'm home. This is lovely. So okay, let's figure out how to get upstairs maps we love them okay hold on <laughs> and she had like a staff stairs. So, <laughs> so she let me use it. So thank you so much. I don't want to get you in trouble, but that was so kind of you feeling the love. So we are on the rooftop. I think you have to enter from like the other end. Um, I am in building B right now. But yeah, let's look at the roof. <laughs> Why is this place so huge? 
been so beautiful. Oh my God. There's just like the layers of people. There's literally everything here. It's cafes, it's eateries, there's a bowling alley, there's a golf academy, you can golf on the roof. Um, there's a cute little poodle down there. Oh my God, there's, geez, this is nuts. It's like four full buildings. Um, wow. So I'm going to walk to the top, look back at where I came, and then uh, let's go into the shade because it is toasty outside. Summer is not over here in Korea. I'm so happy. This is so beautiful. Okay. And at night, actually, bees light up. Um, I've seen the night pictures from here. Gorgeous. So you could just see the umbrella. Ah. So now, I don't know how to get down. I didn't even think about that. I got up here, but how do I get down? Um, let's go. Me feel like you want to die, so I'll compromise. My mind is exploding right now. Well, the mall succeeded in doing what all malls do and that is make me very tired so we're going to head to central park now and maybe take a ferry i don't really know um there are boats there's all kinds of stuff so yeah let's just head in to the park So we are at Tribal, which um, as you can see are like three bowl-like structures. Um, we are directly at Central Park Station. It's right at exit three. Um, and I am going to walk over to the ferry building. There is a west and an east marina. Um, and I'm gonna see if we can ride a ferry over to the east side where we're gonna meet Kurt later. Um, if not, we can just walk through the park that looks beautiful, but um, yeah, it's gorgeous. It's a wonderful day. Let's go. Actually, I keep getting distracted. So I saw this in a few people's pictures when I was researching Songdo. There is this flower field um, that has like these autumn flowers that come out right now um, and they are fully in bloom and I was like where on earth am I gonna find this in the park and luckily I went up on that bridge just to take a little peek and I found it. So we're gonna go see the flowers first and then check on the boat situation, okay? There's just too much and also these apartments have like windows that are kind of like bay windows. Oh, can you imagine? That would be beautiful but anyway flowers. Let's go. Oh my god, guys. The ferry that I was gonna take is passing us right now. It is a packed. Holy smokes, it is busy. I don't know if I can take it. Let's, um, I'll show you how busy it is. This is what we were gonna take to get across the park. <laughs>
world. So most ferries that I have taken in my life have been on like in bays. Um, so it's a little rockier. This was super smooth. It went really fast. And I thought it was gonna take us from the west boat boathouse to the east boathouse. It did, but it then turned around and dropped us back off at the west boathouse. So I thought it was more of like a transportation kind of ferry. Um, it's not, but it was really pretty. It was really nice and that was 4,001. So nice. So now I'm going to walk over to the Hanok village. We're gonna get dinner and then yes, we will be going to those moon boats. Um, I was hoping we would get dropped off at the East Boat House so I could like triple check the uh, like prices and the timing and stuff. Um, so I'm pretty sure you can do it. They advertise it for nighttime. So I'm assuming after seven, it will still be available, but we'll see. Maybe we'll do a little sunset boat ride. Who knows? It's, um, I would say lively, but not crowded. Like it's a nice amount of people. Like it's a lot of families that live here, I think. Um, so it's very kid friendly, dog friendly, although I haven't seen as many dogs. Point off for you, Songdo. <laughs> but um, anyway, let's find shade, head to the Hanok village, find Kurt, and we're gonna get Chinese food. So, see you there. meal um at this is like a very famous chinese restaurant here in the hanok village um we got the course thing and it <laughs> we spent two hours eating so we are very full um but we're going to mosey very slowly over to the moon boats and hopefully we can take them the sun has set i mean we missed sunset <laughs> we were in there eating so and it was delicious kurt said he would come all the way back to songdo just for their tansuyuk correct he also drank beer and doesn't want to be on camera because he's being goofy <laughs> and the world can't know that he's funny. So let's go to our boat. Well, we learned our lesson. It is 7 p.m. on a Saturday and they're out of moon boats um, so that's a bummer but we can take other ones but um, yeah they like warned us ahead of time so we could get out of line if we wanted to but we're gonna wait for the other boats so hmm. put you And put the fall where I can hear Safety A few hundred miles away I hope you listened 
It's very crowded, so I'm a little worried, but it's peaceful. Our light keeps kind of flashing. There's a, there's but... a button that says audio. Try it. <laughs> he said to not talk. Oh, then don't touch it. <laughs> I'm reading <laughs> salvation oh. on highway signs. Oh my gosh, we're going through some rapids. Oh, oh. You and I, it's been quite some time. What? I'm obviously turning this way. Is it a backseat driver? Yeah, they're not even watching us. I know. Huh? Yeah, they aren't watching, but... <laughs> I'm a good driver. I'm a defensive driver. So I'm watching everybody at all times. How are you doing back there? It's nice. I can be your chauffeur from now on. Not gonna make it home tonight But I'll be there <laughs> Hopefully we don't get yelled at. We survived. We have our sea legs, um, but we did it. Kurt did a wonderful job driving. Um, and that was Songdo. This was really fun. Um, even Kurt said he liked it and he's very picky about things. Um, so yeah, it was just a good time. It was honestly like a very good kind of date place especially if you went to that like triple street it had everything there and then to do the like eating and the little moon boat and stuff i don't know it was just very cute you could spend the whole day here for sure so um we are walking to our bus we're gonna take the bus home um but you could take the subway from seoul here um and once again this is songdo in incheon thank you so much to the incheon tourism organization for inviting me here you can check out their Instagram. Almost got hit by a bike, as usual. Um, you can check out their Instagram here, and I'll link it down below. But yeah, I'll catch you guys next time. Thank you, Songdo, for the lovely day. See you then. Bye.